One of these jets is flown by computers. The other is flown by pulleys, cables and raw hydraulics. Same mission, very different philosophy. The Airbus A320 has six flight control computers, three ELACs, elevator and aileron computers, and three SECs, secondary elevator and spoiler computers. When you move the side stick, you're not moving anything directly. You're making a suggestion, and the computer decides how to make the aircraft respond. The Boeing 737, no flight control computers, no fly-by-wire. It's mechanical linkages, control cables, rods and bell cranks. Hydraulic actuators boost the movement, but the pilot is still directly connected to the ailerons, elevators and rudder. In Airbus, the side stick is just a sensor. It has no physical feel of what the plane's doing. The system reads your input, applies flight laws and sends commands to hydraulic actuators. It even limits pitch, roll and angle of attack to protect the aircraft. Boeing believes the pilot should always be in full command. No software limits. If you pull full aft on a 737, the plane will respond. Even if that risks a stall, there's nothing stopping you except training. So what's better? A digital system that protects the aircraft from the pilot or a mechanical system that gives the pilot total freedom and total responsibility. Airbus flies with logic. Boeing flies with feel. Which would you rather be flying when things go wrong?